Hello guys, Chris here. welcome back to another video. In this video I'm going to be testing the GTX 1650, as you can see here, uh, and the Ryzen 7 3700X, but you get the same FPS with something like a 4th Gen i5 or something similar to that, uh, or a Ryzen 5 1400 for example, and I'm going to be testing here Ghost Recon Breakpoint Beta at 1080p low, medium, high and possibly very high or ultra settings, I'm not sure yet because on low settings we are already seeing below 60 FPS as I'm about to show you, so yeah we're gonna start with low settings as you can see now, okay, so yeah, right now we're seeing like 50 plus FPS on low settings which isn't very good of course. Uh, I think I'm just gonna drive here the helicopter for a little bit, we can do whatever we want, we want here because it's an open world game, how do I go up all right shift as you can see yes when we are actually driving the helicopter it's around 60 fps but once we are down there in the wild lands uh, you know uh, wild lands because the other <coughs> uh, <laughs> actually I have no idea how to uh, land this properly okay so I didn't crash it good to see so when we are here we actually see some drops to the 40s as you can see there low uh, high 40s mid 40s eh, you know this graphics card is showing you a bit of age already <laughs> and it just came out this year but no it's just the game that's really really demanding there's a lot of detail a lot of, a lot of stuff to render we're also running uh, some anti-aliasing but that only lowers the fps by like uh, two to three fps at most it's actually like one or two fps lower when you enable anti-aliasing and yeah just running around here we're seeing around 50 fps for the most part like 45 to 55 i think that's probably what you can expect at low settings uh, with the 1650. I'm gonna pick up the helicopter again and do and go there six kilometers. Oh Oh, no, 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 no. Wait. Okay. Okay. We're good. I think I think we're good. Yes, maybe can I Can I steer the helicopter? Can I go to the left? Thank you very much game actually looks okay at low settings the textures are a bit rough and we're also almost consuming 3 gigabytes of VRAM but again there's a lot of stuff to render in this world and uh, every little leaf in the ground or every little piece of grass actually has a texture to it I'm gonna show you right now if you guys haven't seen that already in my previous videos uh, yeah every little piece of vegetation has some texture to it as you can see so that's quite demanding of course you know what guys I'm gonna change it to medium settings because we've already seen a lot on low settings what the hell is this this is a enemy uh, base here guys okay okay so I'm gonna get out of here I'm gonna change to medium settings restart the game and then we're gonna go from there Okay guys, so we're now back at medium settings here. It appears like we've lost our helicopters. <laughs> yeah, that's not very good. Alright, I'm gonna show you the settings. 1080p, and the aliasing is on, otherwise it will just look like a jaggy mess, like a noisy mess, you know? I'm just gonna show you that really quickly. So, everything here is on the medium preset. I'm just gonna be, be disabling here motion blur, as I usually do in my videos. Uh, as you can see, yeah, anti-aliasing off just turns everything into a noisy mess. It looks like a bad camera or something like that at low light. Uh, yeah, every little piece of grass over here also looks really, really bad. There's jaggies all over the place, so that's why I turn on the anti-aliasing, because you don't lose a ton of FPS, you only lose like 1 to 2 FPS, as I showed you already in the previous video as well. And yeah, it looks much, much better, as you can see. Okay, so, uh, let's move on. See if we can get this base, or at least kill some enemy guys. Oh, I thought I had a suppressor in this one. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, we got this, I think. It's fine. It's on the easiest difficulty, so we should be fine. Jesus, what the hell? A juggernaut there. Whoa. Okay, I wasn't really expecting that. Let's go. Let's drop over here. What is this? Oh, it's inside there. I'm gonna go there. By the way, I would like a higher FOV. I'm not sure why it's so uh, small. 
Alright, I got... Ooh, nice. I got a vest. Alright, here we go. We got the vest on. Nice. Oh, there's one. Nice, got him. Graphics here on medium settings actually look pretty damn good. Oh, there's the juggernaut. Oh boy. Okay. Am I gonna die with the easiest difficulty setting here, guys? I hope not. Wow, this is really detailed, guys. Inside of this little place over here. I wasn't expecting it to be. You know? The floors are detailed. Like, can you go through the doors? Wow, what the hell? Whoa! Okay, I got him. Alright. Nice. Got the juggernaut. Can I go here? No. Can I go there? Yes. Oh my gosh. This is so detailed. Alright. So, maybe I'm just gonna get out of here. Move on, you know. Get their helicopter. Game is playable though. Even though we're seeing lower than 50 FPS most of the time here. It's completely playable. Ooh, we got a sniper rifle here. Wait a second. I gotta equip that. Uh, can I get that guy? Nice. Satisfying. It has a... Yeah, it has a little silencer there as well. Alright, let's go. Let's move. Oh. <laughs> Look at the... <laughs> Look at me and that guy. Cuddling together there. In the helicopter. He's just hugging me from behind. So cute. <laughs> so up here we're closer to 60 FPS as we saw on low settings as well. But man, the jump from low settings to medium settings is huge. The medium medium settings really looks great in this game, guys. I'd probably play at these settings. Let's go there and change it to high now. So yeah, the graphics here are amazing now. The textures look okay. And it looks like it's on Ultra as well. So yeah, this game on Ultra actually looks amazing. Completely amazing. I was actually not expecting to see those graphics when I tested the GTX, uh, the GTX 1660 Ti. I'm gonna change the graphics now to high. Alright guys, we're back here on high settings. Let me show you. 1080p, and the aliasing is on of course, and high settings. Just gonna disable motion blur. Alright, let's go. Okay, so I think they're spotting me from somewhere. So now we dropped the FPS by like 5 again, I think, maybe. Nice. Wow, th that that's satisfying actually. True gift technique. Okay. No, I don't want the true gift technique. Come on, get out of here. Can I stop this? No, I can't. Okay then. Well, that's the thumbnail, I guess. Looks pretty damn good, the game, man. I want to look at some textures as well, so let's get out of here. Oof, okay. Just chill, mate. Don't hurt yourself. Alright, here we go. Look at that. It's on high settings, not even on very high ultra or ultimate, because this game still has three presets to go, but it already looks amazing here on high settings. Not bad at all. Especially those purple leaves over there. Yeah, amazing. Oh my god, I just can't stop looking at every single detail here, guys. <laughs> this game looks really, really good. And every single room is so detailed. This game is amazing. I think I'm gonna buy this, guys. Not sure, actually, because it's expensive, but I would like to play it in my free times. Alright, there's a wall here. Okay, so the textures here in the wall aren't bad at all, but, you know, they're definitely worse than, for example, the leaves. Where are they? Oh, there. Nice. Just gonna pick up some car or something like that. A motorcycle. I'm gonna try to get one of these electric cars, actually, first. Can I get those? Or are those just for display or something? Yeah, you can You can only climb on those, so... Let's go! Get in there! Come on! What the hell? <laughs> Seriously? Oh my god, are you kidding me? I can't! Okay, let's get into that one instead. Alright, so that's a little bug, probably like a beta bug, you know? Remember, this game is on beta. It isn't out yet. Yet it looks amazing. 40 FPS is what we're seeing. We already saw it dropping from uh, from 40, of course. Uh, yeah, we're in the 30s now, high 30s. Still, for the graphics it has, it actually looks pretty damn impressive. 
to get the like 30 plus FPS here on high settings at 1080p. I would of course be glad if we see like an optimization patch or something and we get like more FPS but still if you guys want to try out the beta it's free right now on Uplay so give it a try put the graphics on like ultra settings just to see the textures and stuff because it looks really incredible you know what guys it's time I'm gonna change it to very high settings we see that we get like 35 plus FPS here on high settings all of the time all right guys we're back here at very high settings and we we are seeing the FPS dropping by like five I think we were getting like 35 36 here now we're seeing 30 31 32 so but wow, look at that. Now we have some more ambient occlusion. The textures look even more impressive as you can see. Damn it, man. And I haven't show you, shown you the settings. So yeah, let's do, the, let's do that. So NDA leasing is on. Very high settings. And I'll just remove motion blur. Actually, motion blur doesn't do a bad job here in this game. It's uh, like subtle, you know. It makes it feel smoother at lower frame rates actually, so I still don't like it, but just saying that it's not uh, too bad like we've seen in some other games. Alright, let me see. The textures here are a little bit worse, but still, this is amazing, guys. Look at these graphics. I'm really impressed here. And I haven't tested it yet at 1440p, because my, my monitor is actually 1440p and I'm playing at 1080p, so the things are a little bit more blurry than uh, because I'm not playing at a native resolution of course look at that Jesus look at those details man oh my god every single leaf here is so detailed <laughs> Jesus there are some re reflections there in the ground as you can see this is a visual masterpiece I really hope that the missions in the gameplay is good because I haven't experienced it a lot yet you know because if it is it's actually a really damn good game with these graphics the immersion will be awesome in this one let me see the leaves there all right still detailed there look at that Jesus I'm gonna explode that little barrel over there Woof. That was great, actually. I'm gonna explode this one over here. Wow. That still looks awesome as well. Oh, come on. They're coming for us, guys. I just wanted to take a look at the water, but that will have to work to wait a little bit. Okay? So let's see. Oh, I missed. <laughs> How did I miss? <laughs> oh, my God. Can I hit them in the, like, body? Yeah, they die anyway, so... Can I do a collateral? No. Alright, I'm glad I picked up this weapon here. It's on the easiest difficulty as well, as I told you. So, uh, not too bad. Jesus, come on. No. Alright, alright, we got this. Taking a look at the water here. It doesn't look very good. No, I don't think so. Yeah, you can't explore underwater. So, okay. That's not bad. Alright, so 29 FPS there. Yeah, we're really close to 30 FPS here on very high settings. So this is like a console-like experience. If you plug in a controller and lock it at 30 FPS, there's a bit of wildlife here. Oh, he's tired. Oh, no, he picked up a sea cucumber. Okay, I've seen those actually here in Portugal. I dive a little bit sometimes. Okay, now the water looks interesting here. Doesn't look like very watery-ish because of the waves. If you are uh, looking for a console-like experience in this one, and maybe you should be looking at it, because if you can't reach 60 FPS, maybe just log it at 30 and play on very high settings, because the, lo the game looks incredible here. Look at this. But yeah, you could see there the textures were amazing as well on that little leaf or flower. So, just for fun, I'm gonna also test ultimate settings here, just to see how many FPS we can get at those settings. I'm not gonna bother testing ultra settings, because it looks almost the same here as uh, very high settings. It's just the textures get a little bit better, and there's a little bit more effects that you don't really notice. So, yeah, I wouldn't drop the settings from very high if I were you. Okay, what? All right, so I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> I think the game's still probably loading, you know? Oh my god. Okay, guys, so this is not playable, obviously. 4 FPS? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I was actually expecting like 20 FPS or 
maybe 20 no 25 probably would get that in ultra settings uh, but yeah i'm running i'm pressing w by the way and the guy is just moving around weirdly for some reason all right guys so this is just for fun you know uh i you should never play this on ultimate settings obviously if you're getting four fps but the game looks awesome it's it's an awesome slideshow here uh, so if you guys are interested in that, in some PowerPoint in presentations here, uh, yeah, just set it on Ultimate and have happy PowerPoint things. <laughs> but guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video anyways. Uh, the 1650 did pretty well here, considering that this game is a visual masterpiece. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more of this. And uh, I will see you, and I will see you in the next video. Love you all. Bye-bye.